Hey girls, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna bring you a collective makeup haul of some stuff that I did grab. And I'm gonna start off with saying, apologize because I am sick and I'm congested and I have a sore throat. And today is the only day that I can film this week. So um, I'm only gonna get, I think, one video out this week and it's just gonna be my makeup haul video. Um, Cause I do work uh, Thursday and Friday this week. And um, the rest of the week, I'm just kind of busy with a doctor appointment for my daughter and everything. So this is my only day. So I apologize. You're going to have to hear me stuffed up and sounding gross. Um, but I will talk to you about what I got from Sigma. I do live in Minnesota where Sigma is located. And they're located at the Mall of America here. And if, if you're not familiar with what the Mall of America is, um, it's the largest mall in America. Um... It's, it's an amazing mall. We've got like an indoor theme, like theme park, like rides and everything like that. And, um, I don't know how many stores we have here, but obviously it's the biggest mall in America. So there's a lot of stores to shop at. Anyway, um, I've wanted to go to Sigma ever since they moved in and, um, my Sedona lace flat top brush broke. So I did need to go and get a brush. So I did get the Sigma F80 flat top Kabuki brush. So I got that. And I have not used it yet because I wanted to, um, you know, show it on video first. And then I got the, what is this? Uh, F35 Tapered Highlight. Now, one of the things I do like with Sigma is they tell you what the brush is. Um, so instead of looking at this brush going, what is this brush good for? It tells you Tapered Highlight. And then I got the Tapered Face F25 brush. And I got this mainly um, so that when I want to do more of like a highlight and everything, I can just like dust it a little bit further here or I can use it for my contour um, or even like blush too. I wanted to try that out. And then because I did get uh, over $25, I think it was, you did get a free gift. And um, it was the eyeliner E05 brush. Um, so, and it's pink. So I love it. I really wish I could have like a whole set of like pink makeup brushes sets and yeah. Okay, so um, next up I've got, um, I went to Ulta and I did want to show you. And I don't know if I showed this in a previous video or not. Um, when I had gone to Walgreens and got a couple of the new Milani products. Um, so if I've already shown this in another video and I can't remember, sorry. <laughs> I honestly can't remember. I got the Milani Brilliant Shine Lip Gloss in the color Pink Lady. So it looks like that. It's a beautiful pink shade. It's not sticky at all. I'm going to swatch it for you guys. I've got a, I did my foundation this morning and I pumped it out of my hand. So I've got foundation there. So hopefully it's not going to bother you guys and you'll be able to see it. So this is the swatch of the lip gloss. Hopefully you guys are seeing that okay. I don't have a viewfinder behind me right now. If I was in my, my filming room, I would, but I am testing out, um, I bought a light kit, uh, the Cowboy Studio light kit off of Amazon. And right now I've just got two umbrella lights um, currently facing me this way. And I've got another third light um, that came with the kit, but I'm not using that today. Um, but I wanted to test it out for like days that are cloudy. So I wanted to see like how the lighting would be in a video. So I'm in my room because my room is a little darker. So I thought, you know, maybe a mimic, like if it was a cloudy day and I could test the light kit. So that is why I'm in my bedroom today. Um, and then the Milani Eye Tech Extreme Liquid Liner in the color Black is Black. So it looks like this. I'll take off the tip for you and it is just a felt tip liner and as far as I can tell from using it, it is waterproof um I haven't noticed any like um smearing running or anything like that um so I do really like this uh product now the only thing I'll mention with this product is whenever you think it's going to start to dry out a little bit I just take like an old um like a makeup uh remover wipe and I'll just take my tip of my pen and I'll just kind of like um, work it around on it to get the more product to come out and then it's perfectly fine again. So that is something I wanted to mention. And then this is the Milani Lip Intense Liquid Color in the color Fiery Coral. 
I didn't notice it said fiery coral when I bought it. I just saw that it was pink. <laughs> I usually don't like coral colors. So um, let me see what this is going to look like. I have not opened this one yet. So I don't know if this one is sticky or anything like that. The other one, um, it's not sticky. It is, um, it feels thicker on your lips. Um, so that's the best way to describe that one. Um, I really don't know how to describe the scent as. Let me have this. Whoa, that is dark. Holy. That is neon pink. There's nothing coral about that color. That is like a neon pink color. Oh my gosh. I am definitely not going to be able to pull this color off. And there's no way. I don't wear like bright, vibrant pinks. They're all very like, um, you know, like my first one. Um, so we'll see how that goes because I'm not going to be able to wear that color. I, there, I have no idea how I'm going to wear that color. <laughs> I thought it was not going to be that bright. Um, okay, so then let me just wipe, wipe off my swatch here on my pajama pants because I am in pajamas technically right now. My pajama pants, but I've got a regular top on because um, I'm sick and I don't want to get dressed. Okay, so we're going to start with um, NYX. Now, NYX came out with um, new baked blushes and eyeshadows. I have like everything spread out all over now. Um, let me get my stuff organized here because once I open these up, I don't want them to get on my on my comforter. Because so that would not make me happy to get makeup on a white comforter. Okay. So, um, NYX blushes. And I'm going to show you them to you each individually. And I have not opened all of them yet. Um, so the packaging looks like this. Super, super cute and it has a little bow. This one is the color uh, Full on Femme. That's the swatch of this one. And then this one is, let's see here, Chiffon. I'm gonna open these fast so I'm not like taking forever getting these swatches out. And this one is a um, more of like a bronzy type color, I would say. I totally should have opened these prior to the video. Sorry, guys. I am not thinking straight today because I am sick. I'm going to use that as my excuse. If I goof up in my video, it's because I am sick. So we're going to go with that. Okay, so I'm going to swatch this right next to the other one. you guys can see that so it's that one and then I got um, the color called statement red now um, don't let the name fool you because it is not a red um, it is a pink it's more like a hot pink um, but the thing with these blushes are they are not um, vibrant colors so you can get away with wearing um, all of them because they are more like a sheer wash of color so it looks like that. This one's Statement Red. And there is a color that I did want to get, um, but they did not have it. And it was like fetish pink, I believe. So there's the little bit brighter pink. Now, it looks like it might be a little bright, but honestly, I, that's a heavy swatch. So if you take your brush and you swirl it, swirl it around, you're going to be good to go. And then this one is called Foreplay. And I've heard some people say that this, um, reminds them of um, Nars Orgasm. It looks like this. I should have probably showed you the actual like product like that. I apologize. I'll show the other ones on camera. Just swirl that. So then there's the last one right here. And then I'll show you guys. I'll just open them up and I'll show you them all up close. So this was foreplay, and I think I just showed that this one. There's foreplay, and this one is full on femme. This one is chiffon. And 
and then this one is the statement in red and this packaging is so adorable i mean with these bows so super cute and then i did pick up one of their baked shadows in the color vesper and again um just a really cute little bow on it and i'll just watch this next step right here i'll put it right there and it's a um i don't know how to describe the color but it's a really beautiful shade it's got a nice sheen to it not too shimmery so those are um what i got from there <coughs> excuse me guys i probably shouldn't even be filming today because i probably saw my crap and i'm so stuffed up so i probably sound sad and miserable and yes i picked up a another of the um nyx mega shine lip gloss in the color pink gold this is one of my favorite colors so this is my second one <coughs> yeah i love the way they smell got all these swatches on my hands now so that's the color right there okay so let's get into um one of the items that i got i got the laura Geller love is in the air kit um this is this was 25 dollars. it's a 47 47 dollar retail price it comes with a lip gloss and a blush now the blush is just so incredibly cute so it's got the little heart and then the gold highlight in the middle it is just the cutest little it's just so cute um now when you swirl them together where can i put this i'm gonna put it right here that's the color when you swirl it all together it's a beautiful shade the packaging is adorable um the, now the lip gloss on the other hand i do not like um it is in the color perked up pink and on me it is it, the thing about these lip glosses is they are 100% full coverage. They are not a sheer lip gloss whatsoever. But when I put this on my lips, it almost looks coral. And I'll swatch it next to another lipstick here. And like even on the swatch, it's not going to look coral or anything like that. But when I put this color on my lips, it looked like bright, like neon. I don't even know why. Um... But that's what it looks like. And then I picked up the um, Physicians Formula Glow Boosting Beauty Balm BB Bronzer. So it looks like that. I thought there was a like coupon on there that they forgot to take off again. Um, I have heard some good things about this product. So I'm excited to give it a try. I'll take it out so you guys can see it. And the packaging is just really adorable. Um, all physicians formulas, a packaging is just so super cute. So that's what it looks like. And then it has the brush and mirror below. So it looks like that. And if you can hear my daughter, I don't know if you can, but she's watching TV. Um, and she just thinks something is so funny down there. I got that. I'm sorry if this is taking long, guys. I apologize. I got the Happy Booster. Um, this is in the color light bronze. And I just thought this was just so cute. Honestly, like, I bought it for the packaging and just how it looked. I think mean, it just looks so cute. So, you get the product out, and that's actually the bottom of the product. Turn it around, and it's this Happy Booster on the back. And you just twist off. And then they give you two options. You can use a little brush or you can use the powder puff. And then this is the product without hopefully me dropping it. And it just gives like a nice shimmer to your face. That's what that is. And when I went, Positions Formula was um, buy one, get one 50% off. So that came in kind of nice to be able to get a couple of products that have a little bit of a discount. And then the other one I got is the Happy Booster um, in light bronze. This is the Baked Happiness. I have not opened this one at all yet. I, 
I am like on a kick on buying like bronzy stuff right now. And I think it's because like, I'm just so over winter. I just want, I want my, I want my summer. I want it back right now. <laughs> okay. Looks like it had a little bit of fallout going on. Hopefully it didn't move around. Okay. So that is what the color looks like. And I'll just swatch it for you guys. And when you go over it with the gold, um, a lot of the gold comes off. I might have to be careful and use this as a highlight. Um, so the color is right there. Hopefully you guys can see that. I'll try to turn my hand as awkwardly as possible so you can see that swatch. Um, but that is, um, um, I, you know, it's a nice bronzer. And then I got the um, Physician's Formula um, Blush Free Brunettes. And I got the bronzer that's for also brunettes. So I'm excited to see what this one's going to look like. I've got like a swatch of like my whole hand is just pink products. It's crazy. Okay, trying to get the product out. I didn't want this product to come out for sure. And then they forgot to take off like the $3 coupon off. So I didn't get the extra three bucks off. Okay, here we go. So it's just a really adorable packaging. And you open it up, and that is the color for brunettes. And I'm gonna swatch it on my other hand because I'm running out of space. That is a really pretty pink. That's really beautiful. So it looks like this. Hopefully you guys can see that okay. So yeah, that is what I've got um, from Walgreens and CVS, um, no, not CVS, um, Walgreens, Ulta, and then um, Sigma. If you guys have questions or if you want um, separate reviews on anything, always feel free to post them below. And uh, thank you so much for subscribing and welcome to all my new subscribers. And I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.